to the channel oh my god y'all i have not vlogged in like two weeks um we probably need to have a conversation about that but um yeah happy saturday welcome back to a new weekly vlog it's your girl d beasley um <laughs> that sounds so weird to say um i don't even know if i'm gonna vlog the whole weekend i just finished doing some clients um i only had two today but like grab your camera just grab your camera i haven't vlogged with y'all since i um went and did the commercial at the casino so um, welcome back to a new weekly vlog girl uh we do have to have a conversation um i just been trying to take care of me girl so yeah it's been two weeks that i have not um vlogged um Oh child, y'all don't even know the half of it. I don't think I vlogged since, I don't even think I vlogged then, but Memorial Day weekend, I kind of like, it got rough for, for it got rough for me, y'all. Um, I just did, been dealing with a lot of personal things that I'm not even gonna always come on here and share with y'all, but it's not even about like the previous stuff that I was telling y'all about. Um, I feel like, you ever feel like you fell through like the floor or something like or a table fell off. like I just feel like everything is like falling on top of me. Anyway, um I've struggled to get on here with y'all because I didn't want to I didn't want to come on here all sad and like disturbed and stuff like that. Um or irritated, but um I've been having a lot of anxiety issues, so I've been trying to deal with that and I've never um had issues like that before so i've been dealing with that so i decided to take a step back um and to just be with me you know what i'm saying a lot of people won't understand it and a lot of people um try to brush it off or they try to like minimalize what you say um or they expect you to deal with situations how they want you to deal with them and those are the people that you step away from just take a step back and deal with you. And that's exactly what I've been doing. I talk to who I want to talk to. Or, I, you know, not even talk. But you don't allow anybody to make you feel like... I just... Yeah. I just... I've been just taking time with me. Um, it hasn't been the best decision I've made. But I feel like that's the only way I will be okay in the long run. I took a break from social media for a little bit as well. Um, I'm not, I don't even post as much as I usually post. And that is kind of like hard for my, you know, as far as like my business wise goes. So I've been trying to just post only business things. But I've just been trying to be okay, to be honest with y'all. Um, I'm so much better. Um, I'm just real standoffish. You know what I'm saying? And I don't want to be like that, but that's just how I am right now um but that is part of the reason why I have not come on and vlogged um I have not posted a vlog I still have footage from like Mother's Day that I'm more than likely gonna post before y'all see this but um I don't know maybe I'll post all this first and then we'll do like a recap but I don't know if I want to scrap my footage because you know Mother's Day was hard for me as well that's probably why I haven't just, you know, hurry up and just edited that footage and put it out. It was a little hard for me. I had a good Mother's Day though, but it, it turned into, or midday, it was a little rough. Anyway, y'all, I just wanted to come on here and apologize for being missing in action. Um, I had to take time for me. Um, all I do is work, y'all. And I never have time for me. I feel like a lot of things that were going on in my life things that i'm dealing with started to take a toll on me and you don't realize that it's taking a toll on you until you don't want to get out the bed and i've never been that type of person i've never been that type of person so that's when i knew something was wrong 
So take care of you. I'm still taking care of me. I'm still dealing with it. I'm still like anxious a lot. Um, I'm still trying to just get it together, to be honest with you. I just, I mean, it is what it is. I'm, I'm still trying to get it together. But um, I just want to come out here and start another vlog with y'all. Uh, it is June. It's almost the end of June. Y'all, I have not vlogged. I feel like it's been longer than two weeks. <sighs> I feel like it's been longer than two weeks. But I just want to come on here and let y'all know that I was okay. Um, and I'm just trying to... I'm just dealing with stuff how I want to deal with it. Or, dealing, or not dealing with it. But I have to keep going. Because I have a business... Um, I have to deal with but I do have to like make sure I'm good like cuz I ain't good to nobody if I don't take time to make sure I'm good you know what I'm saying um I didn't want to I've had headaches too for the last two days so I'm dealing with that right now but um I didn't want to leave y'all continue to leave y'all hanging when will y'all see this footage I have no freaking idea I may just post it before the other footage and just scrap the other videos I don't really know but I don't want to you know what I mean so but yeah, I just wanted to come on here and let y'all know I was okay again and just to um, let y'all know what's been going on. So, yeah, that's about it. <laughs> um, I did, it is Saturday, uh, June the 24th. Um, I did just finish some clients makeup. I only had two people today and I'm kind of thankful for that because I get a chance to just like chill out get my house together um i have some stuff i have to take to goodwill um i have brushes to clean y'all i have so many brushes to clean i haven't cleaned brushes since before i left for the oakland commercial shoot i have not cleaned brushes um i have to take levon her stuff so we're gonna do that today i have to go pick up a cookie order that i ordered from the cookie shop little rock which is get nail 32 the lady I ordered my acrylics and stuff from that's here so I have to do that I just have a lot to do and I never want to do it you know what I'm saying I have a lot to do and I never want to do it um so I'm trying to get back into the mode of that so um yeah I just want to come on here and tell y'all that I did just receive an order from fancy homebody um i got some new dresses so i'm gonna go wash my hands because i just finished my clients and then we're gonna unpackage um we're gonna unbox those because i want y'all to see those dresses because i'm probably gonna throw one on today but i need to probably need to go ahead and get my cookies too because she is going to be at the place between 12 and 4. cameron has to be at work at 4 and then i'm going to an event my neighbor invited my neighbor invited me uh to something starting at five so he has to be at work at four so that means we're gonna drop him off around 3 45 ish and then head back and come and get ready so let me go ahead and wash my hands and then i'm going to show y'all what we got let me turn this fan off because i hope y'all can hear me i'm just not trying to talk too loud um i hope y'all can hear me another thing while I'm yawning, I've been exhaustingly tired. Um, I mean, when I tell you all I want to do is sleep, all I want to do is sleep. Um, I feel like my brain is in overdrive, and by the time I get home, which is my peaceful space, because when I'm when I'm at working outside, like y'all, I have been real like anxious and real like. You know trying to calm myself down but as soon as i get home i'm calm but um all i want to do is just chill out that's all i want to do so i um i didn't know why i'm yawning there is no reason for me to be on it but just want to come on here <clears throat> let y'all know i'm okay i'm trying to be okay we're gonna be okay and um uh, i'm gonna wash my hands again let me go ahead and wash my hands so i can unpackage these packages so we have two packages from fancy homebody i um actually got my blue bucket bag from glamaholic lifestyle i didn't get a chance oh. never got a chance to show y'all that i got the blue 
um, book it back from Glenaholic finally. And then I ordered her platinum bags. I ordered uh, the mini monogram platinum and then the mini, I mean, then the medium standard. So I'll show y'all those when they come in. I think they come in next week. But I'm gonna show y'all my dresses because this was her last restock. So I just went ahead and grabbed what I wanted to grab. So these are <clears throat> okay, so these are the two maxi dresses I got. I got black and gray. And they come in these bags, fold on nice and neat. Um and it's just a maxi dress with the spaghetti strips. And this is a long one. This is cute. Her material is A1, baby. I got a size large. Very stretchy. Very, very stretchy. And it has the uh, fancy homebody right down the back. But it's very long, too. So this is the maxi. So we got that one. And I got the gray one. Same style. This is the maxi, but it's just like the heather gray. It ain't even heather gray, it's gray. But it's the same. See? I'm trying to show y'all what it's been. But it's really long. It comes to the floor on me. I'm 5'4, so. Next, we got three of the, let's see, what do we get? So next, we got three of the signature ribbed midi tank dresses. Um, I got royal, and I got gray, and I got mango. Super cute. Super, super cute. I'm hungry. Grab me some to eat. So this is the signature. These are ribbed also. But this is mango. Y'all, this is so freaking pretty. Mango. But you see, it's like a different uh, strap. It's like a razor tank almost. Um, it's not as long. See. But it has the fancy body. Fancy. It has the fancy home body tag on the back also. Super stretchy girl. Look, look at this. This is a large. And I got a gray. Same thing. It's the same kind of dress. I've worn this before. I'm going to leave a picture here. I wore a black one. Because um, I have black, mod pink, and like oatmeal or something like that. I got three more. I like this style. So. Really, really cute. I will try these on for y'all, but I ain't got no energy. <laughs> I have none, honey. And lastly, we got Royal. I got this to go with my um, my Glamaholic bag. So let me go grab that real quick. But it's the same situation. Like I said, these are the midi. Um, these are the signature ribbed. These are the signature ribbed midi tank dresses. Cute, cute, cute. Hold on, let me go. I'm gonna grab this bag so y'all can see what I'm talking about. So I picked up the medium bucket bag. It's blue. It comes with a blue dust bag. This is part of her Detroit Pistons. Um, her Detroit Pistons like uh, collab that nobody got a chance to get. But I got the medium. See, the mini was the only version that was available for the collab. So I just got the medium. Really, really cute. Has tassels. And then it has this um, 
strap, but it has a longer strap. It comes with a longer strap. Um, and it has two pockets on the inside. So it has this pocket here. Y'all can't see it. It has that pocket there. Then it has a zipper pocket there. And then it has a thing in the inside that says, buy me a ray. So yeah. But this is a medium. I don't have any mediums. Um, her, all of her bug bags are restocking next week. Next Friday. She been doing a drop every Friday this month of June. So, uh, I think I'm going to get the pink one. The pink and black. Yes, I have to have all colors. So, what? But this is going to go amazingly with my blue midi max. See, I can't wait to wear these. I can't wait to wear them. I don't know where I'm going to go. And buy clothes. Like, I'm going somewhere and I ain't went nowhere. So, but yeah, this will go perfectly with this. I cannot freaking wait. I love her bucket bags. I only have, I have the large red, which I wish I would have got the medium red because the large is a little bit too big, but it's mine. And then I have the blue one now. But yeah, this is the monogram. This is her monogram uh, bags. And yeah, I think I'll probably just hold a camera or I'll probably just carry it like this. So yeah, I got that. But I leave it inside my dust bag. Walk-in closet me, please. Walk-in closet me, please. And like I said, the paint, all of the colors are restocking. And I'm going to, I think I'm going to get the pink and the medium. And the black and medium. Because I feel like medium is my go-to. As far as like bucket bags, the, lar the only large bag I have is the large duffel. I'm in the large bucket in the red and I have a large flat bag. So when the new flat bags come in, I ordered those last week. They're already shipped. I think they'll be here Wednesday or Thursday. When they come in, I'll show y'all those. So I just want to show y'all all these goodies that I got because like I said, I want to wear one of these dresses today when I go and meet up with my neighbor. I think I'm going to wear maybe the gray. The gray, the gray um, midi tank. I think that's the one I'm gonna wear. I may wear this one today. And all of her stuff has that in it. Love, love, love it here. And her fabric, y'all, great quality. Great quality. If y'all have not ordered from her yet, you need to order from her. But yeah, so I'm gonna go grab these cookies real quick and I'll check back in with y'all in a minute. I gotta change my battery out because for some reason it's about to die. So there's that. Alright y'all I'm back. I went ahead and ran up there got my cookies. Cookies here. Um, also stopped by Taboo and picked up my two pairs of shoes that I have purchased from her on her live. She did a sale so I want to show y'all that. Um, just a cute little black. I don't even remember what I got. But I got, oh, I think both of them are black. I both of them black, but I got these. These are $10. Super cute. I need a sandal holder. So I've been looking on Amazon for one. Because um, I got too many, like, little boxes like that. I oh, know these are like a mint color. But they're the same kind of shit. Let's see what this looks like. That was a cute. I could have beat an eight. See, my foot is not wide. So I feel like sometimes a nine would be too big, but my foot not wide at all. But they cute though. You wanna see what they look like? That's what those look like. They're really cute. Oh, yeah. So I got those from her. Like I said, I did get. Never mind. Camera's in the room. I, I, I had 
behind me over my bag. Close my bag right. We close my bag. Going. Close my bag right on back up. Did you see all this for the taste test them? We for the taste test them. But I am talking to the people. Come say hey to the people. We ain't been on the camera in a minute. I got these from Tony for five dollars. Just, just don't put me on the camera. I got these for five. Get smart again. Get smart again. Get smart again. You see how he disrespect his mother hitting me back? <laughs> oh, they ain't seen you since she had the braces in. But I got these from her. And then I got this standard black pair from her too. These were five dollars. Um, she was doing a live when I walked in. And she was selling these. So just a standard black pair. Some cute to throw on. Whatever. She's having these for five. Come on back in here. We finna taste these cookies. I guess I'm I'm not putting none in the microwave. We're gonna taste them right now for what they are. You can put a piece in there in the microwave once you figure that out. Anyway, we got cookies from Get Nailed. I think uh, we need to do like a little. I think I should record it on my phone. Rude. Anyway, I got three of the variety packs, which includes, which can't, that means Cameron only gets one of each cookie. So we got Oreo. She said she fresh, she baked them fresh too because I couldn't pick them up the other day. Oh, that's all. What does that mean? Like, does she this live here? Like, she live here. The girl I be getting my nail stuff from, her name is Get Nail 32. She opened a cookie shop. But anyway, we got the Oreo. Y'all look at that. What? Man, come on now. Stop playing with her. Stop playing with her. We got chocolate chip. And they're huge. Huge. And then we got the banana pudding, I think it's called. Ugh. There's your cookies. And if you don't want one of them, give them back to them. So which one are we trying first? The Oreo? No, we can get the banana pudding. I like the... Do you want to try... you want us to share one of those? Because you may not like it. No, I'm not going to like all these. You know you're going to like... Why you ain't in the frame, bruh? Because it's too tall. And I'm sitting there. Okay, there we go. So we don't, we're going to try the banana pudding on first. Man, why your chocolate chip going to look so big? Mm -hmm, that's how she made it. But okay, come on. Rip me out the plastic I've been acting brand new. You got the big chocolate chip. You got the big banana one. Now wait. Look how big your banana one is. I paid for them. Now. I can't even open it. She got a seal too. I like it. Well, I'm not gonna struggle. I gotta put. I, I gotta. We gotta record. I gotta put it so she can share it. I got some camera. It's hers. And it's mine. Okay, y'all. So we're doing a taste test of the cookie shop, Little Rock, me and my son Cameron um I want to pick up I put up an order in for three of the variety packs y'all we got cookies we got cookies okay so we have to try these out look at this chat what so I had to record this because I wasn't gonna record it at first but I opened this banana one up and I was like it's a banana pudding and I was like oh my god so ugh. she's at a pop-up shop right now too until four o'clock so I put the information on the screen so we're gonna try the banana one first 
And that's what that one looks like. This is banana pudding. Like, look at that, y'all. You ready? Hold on. Hold on. You gonna beat me too. Okay. Is it white chocolate? Oh, that's good, y'all. Oh my god. And it's so fresh. You like that? Mm -hmm. Which one are we gonna try next? Um, the um, chocolate, chocolate chip. chip. Uh -oh. hey, Look how big this is, y'all. Next one is chocolate chip. And they come sealed too. I can see that. And they're so soft. You trying to break a little piece off? That banana one fire. Mm-hmm. I'm saying the nibbling. All right, last we're gonna do Oreo. And she has two different Oreos. This is the regular Oreo. Like this is the regular. And then she has one that's like stuff, I think. I don't know. The banana one my favorite so far, banana pudding. I gotta get one with a little piece of cookie on it. here on the screen so y'all can go ahead and check her out um she placed orders on her site uh i believe on sundays i want to say i'm not really sure but she's at a pop-up shop right now on asher go out there oh i like the banana one camera i'm probably gonna get out of work early today too you are because we got a dishwasher oh so you don't have to wash the dish mm. And I got the cool manager. Who the cool manager? The one that came in like the door last night. Oh, he cool. Why he cool? Cause when it's time for me to deep him, like, I don't gotta do that much. Alright, mm -hmm. other people be saying like 30. That'd be what? I was just like, I gotta deep him on like 30 pieces. Deep bone? Mm -hmm. So you got the deep bone meat? For what? Popeyes. Ooh, them some fresh Popeyes, man. Them Popeyes good. They better than like frozen Popeyes because they're fresh. You see how you just said you had the diva on the meat? Mm -hmm. Oh, we still vlogging. Okay, y'all. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> Baby, we vlogging so long. My favorite is the banana one. I like all of them. They're really good. But I'm gonna put them in this Ziploc bag so they don't go stay your on me. Camera gotta go to work in a couple of hours. And, uh, I ain't doing nothing. I'm supposed to go meet up with my neighbor, hang out with her, whatever. But yeah, we don't have nothing going on, so. How's it warm? Good. 
All right, but I'll catch up with y'all later. I just wanted to show y'all the stuff I had got. Mm, taste these cookies with y'all. I'm sorry, but I had to create a video so I can put it on Instagram because people need to go buy her cookies. They fire. All the people at the pop-up shop was like, Natalie, what is going on? Like, these are good. So. Oh, we saw about Starbucks too. Where's we? Me. Me and the vlog. Well, the vlog went with me. I stopped by Starbucks. Sure. I wish we had a closer second group. Oh, now you hooked. Yes. Now you on them. Forget Tropical Smoothie. Forget Tropical Smoothie, he said. Okay, y'all. So, we're going to taste test of What's the name of it? Blueberry Pomegranate Smoothie. All right, I'll check in with y'all later. Um, yeah, it's hot outside, y'all. What time is it? Real, real hot. I don't know, because they, be, they was open when I picked you up last night, wasn't it? Yeah, they open late. So I'm going to get one afterwards. Okay. All right. Maybe it's a whole nother day. Happy Sunday. Let me pause this. I'm watching Peyton. Um, and now she's um, like Peyton is so freaking motivating, y'all. Like, she part of the reason why I keep and continue to do what I do because um, she literally just said, if you want to do YouTube, do it. And don't let nobody stop you from picking up that camera. So here we are. <laughs> Happy Sunday. Um, I literally just got out the bed. It is like about to be 12 or right at 12. I'm about to get my niece actually. Um, we're going to get her. Camera needs to go to the bank. Um... I didn't show y'all. I don't think I showed y'all. Y'all know how small my room is, so excuse it. Girl, I'm not going to show y'all that. Yep, yeah, Emma. Okay, I'm going to just show y'all this. We got more shoe boxes, but y'all not going to see what's down there. <laughs> but we got more shoe boxes. Um, hopefully that'll be enough. I'm pretty sure that's enough. But, um... Like I said, I just washed my face, brushed my teeth. I'm about to put something on. I think I'm going to put on one of those dresses because I never put it on yesterday. Because I just kind of want to be cute or whatever. Um, so let me figure that out. Um, I got a lot of straightening up to do. Lots of straightening up to do. But I wanted to get my niece. So I'm going to go ahead and straighten my room up a little bit before she gets here. And um, there's that. I just wanted to check in with y'all. Let's say good morning. Um... I do got millions of brushes to wash, so. Oh, Lord. <clears throat> Anywho, I have millions of brushes to wash, so we're going to do that as well. But, um, yeah, I just want to say good morning. And once I get my niece, I come back. Because I need to straighten up around here. So, BRB. Y'all, it's hours later. And we are under a severe thunderstorm watch. And guess what? There is a wind warning. And guess what? My power done got blown out. The transformer done blew out. And it ain't even raining. It's just been the wind been real crazy. It's starting to rain now. But the wind been uh, blowing like crazy. It blew some branches down in the front. And... Um, I got my niece here with me, so there's it. Yeah, it's starting to rain a little bit. But yeah, power's out. I actually heard the transformer like buzzing and then I heard the power shut off. And then so I looked outside and I heard it like mm, and I saw the sparks fly. I was like, not not it done got it. like <laughs> it got knocked out real quick. We just got a notification from energy, but it says she'll be back on by 9 o'clock today, but baby, I don't know. So, there's that. I keep y'all posted. I can't, there's no, there's no power. Like, I can't see in the house. I'm going to light some candles. Um, girl. I got to go pick my son up from work at 9.30. And it's only 6. And like lately, it's been staying like it's actually been. I gotta get up, cut. Hold on. Oh, 
Child, it's not as bright as hell. <sighs> okay. So, power is out. <laughs> power is out. It's thundering outside. I got the back door open. I can't do no more wash my brushes, y'all. Ain't that sad? Okay, I'm gonna light one more candle. When I say I can't do nothing but wash these brushes. So, I got enough lighting around here, so I'm not too worried about that. But, I'm just gonna go ahead and, um, I'm probably gonna put this light on the charger to make sure I have enough battery life. I got my fancy homebody dress on too. I know y'all like, what girl? I know. But I'm just gonna wash the brushes. I mean, hey, no time like the present. So I'm going to grab this towel real quick. That's how it lit. I need to put the rest of her bottle in the refrigerator. But yeah. So, I'm gonna wait on the power to come back home and I'm gonna wash these brushes and I'll just probably check in with y'all tomorrow because this right here is giving, I, I hate when the power is out. It's so freaking annoying. Like it's so annoying because you literally at like, you're waiting on them to figure out what the problem is. So, but I saw that transfer blow. I saw it. Um, I'm going to stick this over here. Let it out. I wish I could drive up the street to see if they working on something, but... It's not even raining that much. I'll check on with y'all. I'll check on with y'all tomorrow because I'm going to know it. <laughs> I'm not a player, I just fuck a lot. But me and Punisher, 